hello everybody welcome back to my channel for another episode of the not so buried challenge so sky here just took a pregnancy test and she is indeed expecting a baby she is she's a, okay so like i kind of messed up I, she was she had neutral when she was supposed to want a baby i could have sworn it was like would love to have a child but i guess it changed um, but we are going to, I don't know why it looks like that. And she, her and Philippe had actually talked about having kids and he, of course, had said that he wanted children as well. And that like, you know, it may not be the best, right? Oh no. How can they not be happy? Sky's partner reacted very poorly to the news of Sky's pregnancy. It's devastating. Sky is so happy about this baby, but her p partner does not want it. And troubling this new news, dismayed after learning that the baby is on the way. Um, and she's not understanding why, because when they had talked about it earlier, um, he had said he wanted children and she's like I thought you'd be happy he's like why would I be happy about this like we are still in college like we can't afford it and she's like what do you we can afford it though we have the inheritance from my from my dad like it's fine and he's like that's not the issue. Like, I still have one full... I mean, he's almost done with his semester, but, like, in Sin's time, he still has quite a while for it. And then so does she. She still needs... Like, he he should get all of his credits um, with these four classes, and he'll be able to graduate. But it's like, we're living in a tiny apartment. We can't afford to have kids right now. And so this is unfortunately going to be kind of a... All right, so obviously he's very angry and she's stressed and so she's actually going to go just leave him be because he's being a total twat Alrighty, so we have had so sky left the house because she needed to get away from philippe he needed time to cool down um they just needed to be apart before they said things that they would regret so she left um, there was no reason, like, he said he would leave, but she was like, no, I, like, I'm pretty cramped up, like, I, I need to go, and, um, so she, she left, and left him with the, with, um, Jasper, um, and she had messaged both Krista and Jack, her two best friends, to kind of explain what happened, unfortunately, Krista wasn't able to make up, but Jack said to meet him at a bar in Mount Komarubi, to be fair, he does not know that she's pregnant, he does not know why, She's just saying that she needed to get away. Um, and so here they are um, at the bar just talking. She's not going to be drinking anything. Don't worry. I won't I won't do that. Um, I do have a thing with the mod. Um, um, she was explaining the, the issues. Um, but I have the mod where, God, I don't even remember what the fuck I'm trying to say. I don't even know what I was saying. Oh, um, with the mod that I have, the pregnancy family and woohoo wellness or whatever, it's not called woohoo wellness anymore, but there is an option to, um, for a miscarriage. So, and especially if you do substance abuse, it's more likely to happen. Oh my goodness, look at the way he's looking at her! Oh no! Oh 
Now, Jack has been our friend since we were, like, young, young teenagers. But, oh my gosh, look at how he's looking at her. She's extremely, she, wait, wait, what? She perceived as very attractive. He's lactose intolerant too. <laughs> Apparently we have a thing for men that can't handle spicy milk. That's my jam. She likes S pop. And so Jack is now confessing the fact that he has had a crush on her forever, but he never wanted to say anything in fear of ruining their friendship. And she's been very emotionally compromised at the moment, and he's saying such sweet things. And she's incredibly hormonal right now, and things are just... not good right now <laughs> i don't like doing this because i never it can i condone cheating and this is really hard uh, i don't like it i don't like it i don't like cheating uh, it's gross ma'am you are like inside of each other and not in the way that's that's hot Will you please kiss him? Ugh. I hate this. <laughs> um. She's woohooing with Jack right now. And I hate it. <laughs> Why? Why would you do this to me, Simsy? Why? Why would you make this something that has to be done? Her lipstick is two different colors. It's just such a dead stare, like... Oh, goodness! <laughs> We're just, I'm just going to say that they went to a hotel. Um, so her, it is 3 a.m. It is 3.30 in the morning. And her phone has been blowing off the hook. Like, um, Philippe keeps calling. He keeps being like, where are you? Like, like, I don't understand, like, where you, like, where you are. And he's worried about her. I mean, she just disappeared. And he doesn't understand where she disappeared to. She's not answering her phone. And it's just, it's concerning, you know? And she's ignoring him. She's, can she not get him the hot? <gasps> that's, I mean, that yeah, that's true. You don't want to cook the baby, but oh. But like, you can even see, he's really tense right now. And he just doesn't know where she is. And he's worried about her. She just disappeared. Just, you know, she's only, it's 5 a.m. now. She has literally been gone all day. All night. And he's... Oh my god. I just spilt my fries off. No. It is 5.50 a.m. She should be more tired, realistically. Like, realistically, she should be tired. But, uh, we're not gonna worry about that. No, you are not going to go all the way to your mom. There. She can go to you. And so, obviously, she comes in, and she's like, oh, it's my baby, because she loves, oh, it's Thanksgiving. Lovely. Um, and he's going to get off his computer, and he's going to run in here. Can I apologize? Okay, well, I don't have a option for, um, 
apologizing, which makes sense, I guess, under the circumstances. But um, he's going to come to here and he's going to apologize. He's like, I am, I'm sorry, you're, you're right, we had discussed it, and I, I thought, like, I, we had made it clear that we were going to wait until at least I got a job. He's going to basically say that he's sorry for the way he acted. It was unnecessary for him to yell and scream that it was, and that he is excited for this baby, it's just that it's going to be stressful and that, that and it, he knows that he reacted in a way that wasn't okay. He shouldn't have yelled to her, at her. It's not like, like, obviously it takes two to tango and like, you know, but, and so he's explaining to her kind of like where his mind was with being stressed, with being so close to graduation just to have this to happen, like, and the, how he kind of wants one of their children to not be an accident. Um, and she is, of course, riddled with guilt about the fact that she had an affair. Like, she just assumed that, like, he was going to leave her, which is extreme. And there's really no reason for her to have had that extreme of a reaction. But she did. And she was worried that he would... That he would leave her. And so she obviously slept with Jack, and that's a huge, like, betrayal of trust right there. I'm really hating that because he got living with his family that it says that they're they're not siblings for fuck's sake. So she's obviously upset with herself. I don't know. I can never condone cheating in any way. So I can't think of any reasons as to why what happened would be the right reaction to what happened. They had an argument and she left to go sleep with her best friend. Like it's messed up. Oh, it's also, oh shit, it's also, um, Jasper's birthday, so we'll have, or maybe not, what are we doing? We're gonna have him cook up a ham dinner, and then probably make a cake as well. But obviously they're still really awkward around each other, um, he's long since accepted like, like, while she was gone, he had time to cool down and really think about it. And he was like, I did react way out of line. I shouldn't have sworn or gotten upset with her like I did because it's not just her fault. Like, it's it's my kid, too. Um, but he's very stressed with the last bit of his school. And he just doesn't want to, like... He, I don't know. He's also, again, wants at least one of his children to be planned. And so it's a bit... It's just like, he wishes that it had happened differently. And she... So he feels guilty because he thinks that he just, like, hurt her feelings. Which he did. Like, I'm not lying. He definitely did do, do that. Oh, that's my coffee table. But I don't know what I need. Oh, because I went dumpster diving. That's right. I was like, where is this? Is this the fridge? What are you doing? No! No, I will not be your girlfriend, actually. Jack, you need to leave. We cannot know. Belief can never know. 
What happened? I don't care, child. Please go away. And now we're messing up things with Jack. Like we're losing him as a friend too because of that. It just goes to show that um, you shouldn't cheat because nothing ever goes well for people that cheat. Can I confess to the affair or is that not? Not that I'm going to because that literally is against the rules. Okay, well it's Thursday so she will not be having another class with Beyond the Selfie, which I might just have her do the homework just because I do need her to do the term papers and then I do need her to do the homework for restaurant nearing. And then dad, all of his are done. When did you get your what? I don't remember. When did you do your homework? Okay, well, whatever. It says it's complete. It might be glitching out for some reason. But I am going to actually have him study, though. Why are you awake? Okay, you're not. You're going to sleep. Good. Oh, yeah, so she's just stewing away in guilt. He thinks that she just... Like, he doesn't know where she went. She is obviously not telling him her obvious reasons um they did use protection though and there's no risk of her getting pregnant because ah birthday oh my god um and there's no risk of her getting pregnant because she's already pregnant but there are other things that could happen um i'm gonna make a chocolate cake i'm gonna have him study just a bit just until his um skill goes up we need to go to the doctor and I am going to actually buy a sleep replacement potion because she needs to get this work done. She does have to head to the doctor though because she is having some fishy, some fishiness down there. Um, so we'll see if it's just a yeast infection or if it's, because apparently there's also, you who transmitted diseases which i didn't know about until i was playing my 100 baby challenge and my sim got a wtd i was like oh okay come on get your skill up what skill is this charisma it might be charisma which is taking him a long time mm, yeast infection okay it's writing skill um i'm gonna have her actually appreciate this and then we're going to watch sports while Philippe is making a cake usually she's the one that cooks but he's trying to like be um a good like husband and try to help out and doesn't want to put any sort of strain on their relationship anymore than because he's like i'm on thin ice i'm in the doghouse not realizing that what she did is a lot worse than him having kind of a negative reaction to the pregnancy announcement. Oh no, is there a fire? For fuck's sake, Philippe! The cake's fine. I can't even click on the damn fire. And my fucking alarm isn't working. the fire out no you're fine do not pick up the child he's fine oh my fucking god there's no fire I swear to god if you do not put that child down now okay well he has exams to study for. We're going to quickly age him up. Oh my god, you're gonna miss your child's birthday. And 
he's going to be lazy. Okay. Wow, you got a lot of gifts. Okay, so she, as you could tell, I went ahead and gave her the um, sleep replacement potion so that she can work on her homework. So I'm probably, once he graduates, which will be tomorrow, because um, he's already done his presentation and all he has to do is exams now. Um, so when he wakes up, I'll have him obviously study for exams. She's just going to be pulling out an all-nighter. Okay, I went ahead and got the homework for the next class done. And then I need her to come and I need to edit the term papers. Luckily, I've already kind of been working on them off camera, the, uh, like the actual papers themselves. So now she just has to edit and then submit them. When is his first class? His first class is at 8 a.m. and then there's one at 11 and then there's one at 1. 30. We really don't have that much time. Which class comes first? Your entertaining endings. So I might have him wake up. Oh, he's waking up right now. Cool. We'll have him go ahead and do that. So we're going to submit the, uh, the selfie one because that one's that one. And then we are going to come and edit beyond the seafood. Studying for his exam. She is not studying for her exam and I feel like she should. But it is also cooking and her cooking is like really, really good. So I think she'll be okay. She's fine. She's fine. She's just stressed. Okay. And then he'll go to, to this class, come back. I'll have him study for this class for a little bit. And then when he gets back from here, we'll have him study for this one for a little bit. Just put this in your inventory. I swear to God. No, stop. There's like a part of me that just wants to like sell the bookshelf. So then they stop doing that. Alrighty, well this is her last class. He has, I hate that, it's weird that he has three classes, but. Oh, look at you. We'll take a look at him in cast in a minute. Alrighty, Philippe is back. Let's see, what is his, it's, his next class is herbalism, right? Yes. So I'm gonna have, oh, he can't study herbalism. What the fuck? I mean, he should be fine. I could have him read his book on herbalism that he keeps putting away. I'm gonna have him like build up his skill a bit on that. Why are you not reading the goddamn book? I am trying. You're too uncomfortable. Fuck you. Read your goddamn book. If she is uncomfortable to the point that she literally had four things that were all uncomfortable, what are you doing? No. Do what I told you to do. I told you to do university. Did you, did you submit it? You were supposed to work on it. I'm pretty sure it said edit. Okay, well, well he's off. She was supposed to edit. He had plenty of time to edit. She didn't, oh my God. She might fail that class. Okay, I don't know why her lipstick's different color. I don't remember clicking on that. I don't have, oh my god. I can't even change her teeth. For fuck's sake. Oh, this is a cute outfit. He has his mom's eyes. He has his hazel eyes. So yeah, so Jasper has black hair like his dad, but then hazel eyes like his mom. That's so cute. Fine. But he's such a cutie patootie. I love him. Um, We need to also get him some stuff for him because he is an artistic sim. He definitely, he like enjoys 
the arts. So we, okay. Oh my God. Okay. We got a baby on the way. I am hoping that, oh God, I don't even have room. We have to get rid of the computer to be able to put the baby right there. Don't want to do that. I mean, I might actually have him get into music. It's so rare that I actually have my sons do music. Draw pictures while inspired, huh? Well, you're not inspired, but what do you... You've got a giant friend from hugging the oversized animal. That is adorable. Nope, not just a shower. You need to take a thoughtful shower. And you can go ahead and draw some pictures. But, so there's this thing that I saw just like off camera is... Like, she clicked on um, Jasper when he was a toddler, and there was an option to um, ask if Jasper wants siblings. And I got a pop-up that said, yeah, your parent asked if you wanted to siblings, how do you react? And I was like, yeah, I feel like that would be cool. All right, I don't think he has time to study for this exam, but I will have him at least go potty. she in her second trimester? Oh my goodness, she is. She's encouraging him. That's so cute. That's... Okay, we are going to tell him that we are pregnant. He's excited. That's so cute. New sibling. Jasper can't wait to play with the new sibling. <laughs> Stop it. That's that's so cute. Um, I need you to draw a vehicle because that will be something different. And he already has a pretty high um, creative skill because he had his skills were maxed out as a toddler. So he starts out with level 3. And he just leveled up to 4. So that's cool. So yeah, he starts... Oh, he starts out with just below two so it's close but not quite he's feeling irritable great teacher guy is masterful instructor whose greatest reward is an improvement of her pupils because you were encouraging him when he was okay we need to reach level five or uh, six of our parenting skill we need to have child reach character value is this the last of the things i don't think it is no and then we have to help with homework for th four hours. For some reason, there's already two. I think it's from helping her siblings. Um, and then achieve level 10 of parenting, go into full parent mode, and have child with three positive character values. Okay, that shouldn't be too difficult. Um, manners and responsibility are super easy to do. You just have them, like, um, do their homework and then have them do chores and their manners and responsibility get up really fast it's the other ones that i have a hard time with i believe just got back from school and this is his last class it is i'm actually gonna go have him go jogging well, Sammy got engaged, too. I don't know if I mentioned that in the last part. Okay, she's gonna go to the hospital and figure out the gender of her baby. Um, I wish that Philippe could come with. I feel like that would definitely be something that he should be a part of, but... Alright, so he got A+, plus, A+, plus, C, and a D-. minus. Oh, he did not do very good on his herbalism. But that's okay. And she got a C... On gourmet cooking, A plus on restaurant, on just regular old cooking, and then a B minus on photography. That's actually the best that she has done in photography this whole time. How many classes? She needs five classes, so I can do the four, and then just have her do one. That just that seems dumb. Is there anything here that she can do? Pet training? No. Parenting, I could do a parenting class. But at the same time, her parenting skill will get up 
pretty fine on her own. I just hate that it's an odd number. Oh, should we... Oh. Just pay it straight out? That's quite a bit of money. I did pay off your bills, right? Like, you don't have any... Right? I think I paid off... Ah, oh, shit, I didn't. Graduation ceremony is tomorrow. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and pay 2000 on his. You are pregnant with one baby and you will have a girl. She's pregnant with a girl. Wake up, I got something to tell you. Time to nap for many. This is fun, nice. We can take a nap later. Ah, she's about to pass out. No. Oh my goodness, child. Okay, um need you to announce baby's birth gender. Her baby bump is so big, but it's poking out. <laughs> anyway, I need to be ending this episode here. In the next part, we will be having our baby girl. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Um, we will also have graduation. He will be graduating officially and will be able to get his job as a lawyer, I believe, is what he's going for. Um, and then we'll, she'll be able to start her class hate that it's an odd number um but she'll get these yeah let's see it's just cooking and gourmet cooking so that should be easy enough skills to get uh, her cooking is almost nine dang the gourmet cooking we can work on but anyway i want to be ending this episode here so if you enjoyed please do like comment down below what you thought what you'd like to see next subscribe if you're new and see you next time.